Hello, and welcome to the trial of the Case Systems Management Appliance. In this tutorial video, I'm going to show you how to install the Case Systems Management Agent on your device for the seven day cloud hosted trial. To get started, if you haven't already registered for the seven day trial, you may do so at this time by visiting the URL listed up here. Once you enter in your information on the right here, you should be presented with a Start Virtual Trial button. Once you do this, in about two or three minutes, you should receive an email with the link and instructions on accessing your trial that should look something similar to this. Simply click this link and it will then take you to the login page for your seven day trial. And it should look something like this. From here, it may take a few minutes for the appliance to boot up and get started. You should see a progress bar in the background here, and you may see a little dialog box here in the screen telling you that it's booting it up. This may take two or three minutes depending on you know, what time of day it is and other factors. If you have issues with this part of the trial, please contact your sales team or sales engineer and they'll be more than happy to assist you. Once you see this environment is ready, you should be able to now click the K1000 admin portal link up here. From here, you want to log in to the interface. I've already logged in in this example. Up here is the login credentials that you'll use to get into the admin interface. Once you're logged in, we're gonna click settings, provisioning, update agents. From here, you should see a couple links down here for the different versions of the agent. I'm going to click the one here where it says Windows version, and that will download a zip file down here. Once this finishes, you want to extract that file out and view its contents. Once it's finished downloading, you should see something similar to this, these two batch files, and what we're interested in is this MSI file here. And to install the agent, just simply double click it to, to start the install wizard here. You will not need to worry about entering in any kind of name for the appliance, as the name of your appliance is already included here in the name of your MSI file. That is this name here, starting with UV and ending with SR. You can actually take this and even plug this into a URL, or you can also ping this from command line and it should resolve. If you're not able to do that, please contact your sales team for assistance. Once you click next, next and OK and walk through the wizard, the agent will be installed. It should only take about a minute or so. And you should be presented with a screen that looks similar to this. You should see all these various EXEs and files here in the C program files x86 quest case directory. Once the agent is installed, it will take about two or three minutes for the inventory to complete and upload its inventory. While you're waiting, you can click the auto refresh option under devices inventory and wait for the inventory to show up. It should take about two or three minutes and once it's complete, it should automatically show up here in your list. If it takes longer than four to five minutes, there could be an issue with DNS resolution or some other networking problem. If you have any problems, don't hesitate to reach out to your sales team. Once the agent's installed, you can simply click its name and view all of its details, such as hardware and software information, and much, much more. And this concludes the tutorial video for installing the Case Systems Management Agent for your seven-day cloud-hosted trial. Thank you, and have a wonderful day, and thank you for choosing Case.